is one of five crime scenes roped off in Rock Hill tonight. Police say just after two this afternoon, a man came in and robbed this Bank of America on Dave Lyle Boulevard. Police say the bank robber fired at least 10 shots at police as he left the scene, then led them on a wild chase.
Suskin live in York County with more about our top local story. Greg? 
Well, there were several shootouts, but the final shootout happened right here at this garbage dump site at Neely Store Road and Highway 21, where police say a man who robbed the Bank of America on Dave Law Boulevard was shot several times and fell to the ground right here behind me. After robbing the bank, police say the man led them on a chase, a high-speed chase from Dave Law Boulevard down to Highway 21, stopping his car at several different places to fire an automatic rifle at police officers. Several police cruisers were shot up, but no officers were hurt. However, Jim Black was dumping some trash here at this convenience center when he saw the man pull in and race at him with a gun. This guy come flying around the corner, slammed into the fence and landed about 20 feet from me, jumped out with his assault rifle, started running at me. I jumped out of my truck and I started running the other way. And uh, then all the cops come pouring around the corner and then the gunfire started. Now take a look at that white pickup there with the red cab on the back. That's Jim Black's truck, and as we pull out just a little bit, you can see the brown SUV in the foreground. That's the suspect's car there at the dump site, so you can get an idea of just how close together they were when all of this happened. Now right now, the things we don't know, we still don't know this man's name. We know he was pronounced dead at Piedmont Medical Center this afternoon. There was no tag on that brown SUV, and tonight, police still trying to identify him. We're live in York County. Greg Suskin, Channel 9, Eyewitness News. Chopper 9 Sky Zoom flew over the scene where the chase ended Friday afternoon. You can see bullet holes in a police squad car. Several hit the windshield and the hood, but the officer in that car was not hit. Many questions have been answered concerning the police shootout in Rock Hill. 35-year-old John David Phillips has now been identified as the suspect that committed the armed robbery at the Manchester Village Bank of America. He then led Rock Hill and York County Sheriff officers on a high-speed chase down Springdale Road where shots were fired. The chase ended near the convenience center off of Highway 21 where more shots were fired. Phillips was shot by officers and later pronounced dead at a local hospital. Chief Gregory says he is very proud of the work his department and officers did. He says this def definitely wasn't a typical day. But his officers acted very professionally while putting their lives on the line. And uh, in their lives, they could have lost their lives. There were, there was a, it, there was a situation where one officer's actually his tie was shot uh, and almost split in half by one of the rounds from the uh, rifle. That gives you how close he came to meet his maker.